Taking a look at your future track on this Friday evening, looks like things will be rather clear. There will be the potential for a stray shower or thunderstorm. That really dies down after we get past around 7 o'clock or so, so all those football games should be fine as we go through the evening. We'll wake up with a few clouds on your Saturday, and then in the afternoon, can't rule out a shower or a thunderstorm, but chances are even lower than 10%. I think it's going to be a partly cloudy day for your Saturday. We'll remain humid and hot, though. Sunday, though, as we head into Sunday, we'll start off fine, but heading into the evening, we'll watch a front approaching from the north and that'll bring with it the potential for some showers and thunderstorms in the evening. I think things are dry for most of the afternoon, but in the late afternoon and evening hours is when we'll be watching for that potential for showers and thunderstorms on Sunday. Things remain muggy and warm till then. Temperatures falling down to the 70s by Saturday morning and the afternoon once again climbing up into the mid 90s. Another hot day for this time of year. We'll expect the same on Sunday too, starting off muggy and potentially even a tad warmer on Sunday. Temperatures may be climbing into the upper 90s in some areas and then that front arrives and boy, let me tell you how much it cools down. Take a look at this. 94 Saturday. We're at 95 on Sunday. Chances of rain Sunday night and the Monday morning. Look at Monday. 75. That fall feel. Finally coming into Central Texas. We'll warm up a little bit behind it. And then another front arrives just in time for next weekend. Look at next weekend. Once we get out of these rain chances Thursday and Friday, mid to lower 70s for highs Saturday and Sunday. That fall feel looks like it's finally coming back to Central Texas. I know everyone's excited. That's a look at your updated 10-day forecast. Thanks for watching First Alert 25. I'm meteorologist Josh Johns.